Hi Virgo, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the entire month of May 2017. I also want to remind you that your current weekly videos are up as well, so be sure to check those out. If you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. And if you're looking for a personal reading, please join me on my website at www.ms-swami.com. Virgo, um, month of May, I'm going to describe as an emotional month for you guys. I see a lot of high points and a lot of low points. Good news is the low points are very brief and passing. Um, it does show that you're moving away from negative people or negative things, anything negative around you, you're staring away from. Uh, looks like there's some good business deals. Uh, there's some type of celebration going right back to new money and good business deals all over again. And just showing that in the personal life that you need to keep your options open or kind of rethink your options there. So let's take a look. This is for Virgo for the entire month of May 2017. Virgo, we start with the major kind of the star, followed by the Four of Wands, followed by the Hangman, the Knight of Cups, the Two of Wands, and the major or kind of the chariot. Great spread, Virgo. Okay, we're starting with the star. The star is indicating some delays and plans. Something that you want to come through is not going to come through just yet, but it will come through later in the month. Four of Wands shows the happy home, but then when we look here, we have the hangman. And the hangman is not so much of what I see for you guys, is what you're feeling. And what you're feeling at this point in time is you're feeling stuck. You're feeling like you're not moving forward, you're not moving backwards. Just not a whole lot of movement around you guys right now, and that's perfectly acceptable. <clears throat> the Knight of Cups, the Two of Wands, and the Chariot. First of all, let me say, for my single Virgos out there, there's a lot going on in the love life. Um, probably more than one when it comes to communication. If for my Virgos that are in a relationship, uh, married or whatnot, this does look like good, open, honest communication for you. Two of Wands indicates um, decisions to make, okay? And this is overall in general. This doesn't apply to whether it's your personal life or your career because this is um, a general video for all of you. It just shows that you have some upcoming decisions to make. But the Chariot indicates you make the correct decisions. The Chariot is the yes answer. This is the move forward. This is everything you want coming to pass. So definitely a great card for you guys. We have the Four of Pentacles, Major Arcana of the Sun, and then we have the Page of Pentacles. And don't throw out a whole lot of zodiac signs for you guys, but for whatever reason, Capricorn is jumping out, so that could be significant or resonate with you in some way. Four of Pentacles indicates wise financial decisions. So remember that as you go through the month, okay? Don't, um, don't overspend this month. Save some for a rainy day. Beside that, we have the sun going hand in hand with the chariot. Doesn't get better than that. Shows that the sun is shining brightly and that things are going your way. This is also the indication of good luck and abundance. And then we have that page of pentacles. This is an unexpected offer of assistance. And for a lot of you, it's going to be financial. So let's take a look at your major arcanas for the month. We started off with the delay. We have that feeling of you being stuck. And please remember, guys, that this does appear to be brief in passing because y'all come out with the combination of the chariot and the sun. Everything you want in the sun shining brightly. So this indicates to me that your month may start off a little slow and really pick up as the month goes on. But overall, a fantastic month of May for Virgo. Thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye.